Where do chickens grow? On eggplants. <laughs> Guess that doesn't really work if you call them aubergine or guinea squash. Either way, we're making Chinese eggplant salad today. So today we are using Chinese eggplants. You want to pick one that has nice firm skin and a deep purple color and is nice and shiny so that it retains as much purple color as possible while you're cooking it. So we're using about one tablespoon of ginger, three cloves of garlic, one chili, some green onions, about one tablespoon of sesame seeds, one tablespoon of white sugar, and we'll also be using some rice wine vinegar. So you'll want to take your eggplants, cut the end off of them, then we'll cut them into about thirds depending on how big the eggplants are, and then you'll want to cut those pieces into half as well for boiling. Okay, so little tip, you're going to add some lemon juice to the water so it changes the pH balance so we don't get brown skin. You're going to put them right in the boiling water, and we're also going to use something to push the eggplants into the water so they are not exposed to the oxygen outside and that will also help it to keep it purple. I'm no scientist but so far it's worked pretty well. So after about four or five minutes you want to pull them out of the boiling water into a separate bowl. You don't want them too mushy, you want a little bit of texture to them so that they still have a little bit of chew. So you're going to add some olive oil the ginger, garlic, and chilies, and you're just gonna sweat them off for a bit in the oil, about two minutes over medium heat. Okay, so you're gonna wanna transfer that to another bowl. To that, you're going to add two tablespoons of rice wine vinegar, the white sugar, some of the green onions, save a little bit for garnish, also the sesame seeds, Give it a nice stir to incorporate everything. And don't forget a little pinch of salt. So because of our little tricks, it kept its purple color. It didn't turn the light brown color that it normally does. All right, so once the pieces are cooled, you're going to want to cut them in half again or in thirds if they're a little bit bigger piece. So now you're going to want to add all of those pieces to our dressing or our marinade. Give it a nice mix. The eggplant will soak up all of those flavors and it will be delicious. There you have it, a delicious Chinese eggplant salad. You can add some more green onions, a little more sesame seeds as garnish. If you've never tried eggplant or you don't like eggplant, please give this recipe a try. It will definitely change your mind. Thank you for watching this episode of Cooking with the Big Guy, and we'll see you next time.